It's a shield of protection. Doses of the coronavirus vaccine going straight into the arms of first responders. At first, I was a little apprehensive, just like most people are. You know, something new, something that's kind of been rushed out pretty quick. Abilene Fire Chief Candy Flores, one of about 60 in the department to get the Pfizer vaccine through Hendrick Medical Center. No sickness, no headache, no fatigue. Uh, so I was actually felt pretty good. He was also one of the more than 40 firefighters who tested positive for the coronavirus during a department wide outbreak in April. And how does it feel now to have this vaccine that could, you know, prevent something like that from happening in the future? That gives us a lot of confidence moving forward, knowing that our personnel have some protection, have more protection than what we can give them, but have that protection going forward to uh, to, to serve the public and do their job and uh, be as safe as possible. Those who strap on the bunker gear want to help save lives. We'll continue to do that and we'll continue to do everything we can uh, to be part of the solution and not the problem, which in includes uh, becoming vaccinated. Daniela Ibarra, K Texas News.